All right, Catherine, thanks. As protesters continue over the death of George Floyd, one artist found a way to permanently honor the Minnesota man here locally. But the artist has received some backlash on social media from some people who don't support that movement. Five News reporter Bailey Devane has that story. Since the mural's completion, not everyone has been supportive on social media. The artist declined an interview saying he did not want to bring any more negative attention to the mural or the movement itself. You know, and I know he's going to get a lot of feedback on it because a lot of people are against it. But they ought to be for it because he's reaching out to people, letting them know that this young man was killed for no reason whatsoever. He shouldn't have been. It should have never happened. The mural looks over the corner of East 7th Street and Washington Avenue in Fayetteville. Here, some members of the community lighting candles in Floyd's honor. I mean, I, I grieve for his family, you know, his, his daughter, you know, the city, people, his friends, everyone. Even with the chance of backlash, this artist says it's their job to show the state of the world through art. And he's expressing a memorial of empathy to what's happening in the world, and I think that's extremely positive. Floyd is shown alongside paintings of Malcolm X, Martin Luther King Jr., and other historical figures. Some people who live on the street think this mural is an important reminder. I think it's great for people to see and people to remember. The thing is, we can't forget. The moment you forget and the moment you stop talking about it, that's the moment everyone else forgets. If you want to see this mural in person, again, it is on the corner of East 7th Street and Washington Avenue. In Fayetteville, covering news where you live, Bailey Devane, 5 News.